But I got these snug enough where we could lift it. Let's get Jack's hands under it and get it up there. And then I'll double check it with the plumbing going down. Too, and that would give you the same reference. Barely kick into the back. Okay. So we need to go down, I don't know, I'd say two teeth, but I couldn't be close. Just drop them down and get it to where you need to be. Yeah. 
Yeah. I'm one, two. Yeah, yeah, same. We're good.
Things got so sharp here. Huh? Things got so sharp here. Grease stuck in the <laughs> spring pad. <laughs> it's like a little sterno on it. <laughs> The mine that bought this thing, yeah. they went and bought all the gadgets you could buy with it. You just off the <laughs> out. Yeah, they bought a bare stock rock star and put all the shit on it. I don't know why more people don't do it. Well, it's hard to control. 
maybe. One guy rolls whole bed over, but he's a dumbass. He didn't have no loading straps or anything. Yeah. It's kind of where I was getting with it, you know? So, you gotta have something that stops it. You can only go so far. I mean, my limiting straps always in my shocks. Yeah, they're so cheap. Limiting yeah. straps are cheap. I, I mean, the whole time you grew up, were your limiting straps your shocks? Using the springs because I didn't have good enough springs, but yeah. And get it out of the shocks. I think I'm about to do this, get ready to go to Idaho. You gonna take this one to Idaho, you think, or you think you can take that one? That one. Yeah, you can drive it up the street there. Yeah, but I gotta tow the top off. Yeah? I don't wanna tow it with that top off. Got it. Nice. 70 miles an hour for seven hours. No, the, you know these diesel freaks, they sell one, flip kits, yep. and it's a thing that sits on the top and a thing that goes over the bottom and it bolts together, you don't even weld it on. Uh, so, weld it has to be so much stronger. Yeah. No, they're not coming off, I'm not. You got a little worried about it. You got someone that works in your shop and goes and does this all day? No. Oh, that looks so much better, huh? Yeah. I mean, I'll, when I'm all done, I'll spray the whole shop down with degreaser and I'll get my broom out, mop it, and hose it out. But as long as you keep it somewhat clean up to that point. Wait, well, you're <laughs> set up now. Yeah. No, it's dialed. Oh, uh, just gotta put the U bolts on the back. Throw the tires on, and, and then I think I'm Definitely, you're gonna have to be swapped out the front ones. My side, I'm almost on enough legs. Yeah. Yeah. Only so much thing in life. 
This is a run today of the tackle act. Tackle act? Yeah, tackle act leg. Above trout leg? Oh, yeah. Yeah, so. Are they running up from four corners up there? No, I think they're running from trout lake. Oh, uh, a lot quicker. Way in. I don't know that. It's a big tire class, like 49s and 47s. Well, I imagine there's six feet of <laughs> snow there. Yep. So it, it's hard going. Yeah, I don't think it'll be a walk in the park for people. You know, Flurry's up there in 47. And, uh,
will let you tuck in deeper too. Where you can can leave her in and not know you're in her fender well. Yeah. You got big tires and take this shit like this up. Well. Shocks. No, I think it's Dude. cool. Yeah, I think it's kind of awesome. It's going to be great. I think it's going to be. Oh, yeah. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be great. Will it be perfect? Never. Nothing ever is. No. But that's all right. Like, if something's off or something, just loosen the bolt and jam a shim in there and tighten it back up. Uh, no, I just want this thing to fucking four wheel kill it. Alright, so with 38s or 39s on this, you're gonna have exact, you're gonna almost be able to back up to a wall. Yeah, pretty close. Yeah, and if we move it back, one point came back, I measure it. definitely they're, they're just in from the end of the bumper. Yeah. So, which is perfect for competitions. Uh, I like to start entering Wee Rock every year. 